Chef's Blog, February 16th, 2020. I arrive at Washington, D.C.'s Little Pearl restaurant in the Lincoln Park neighborhood. This one Michelin star restaurant is one of the cheapest meals that you can get in Washington, D.C. This doubles as a cafe in the morning and a wine bar at night. The menu is a tasting menu. However, they also feature some off the menu snacks. I started my meal with a shrub consisting of pear and chai spice. Sweet, sour, spicy, especially to start my meal off. The tasting menu consisted of a macaron of deviled egg, light and airy, and a great compliment to start the meal. The bread course consisted of a demi baguette with butter infused with Topico. A nice umami and salty compliment to the warm, crusty bread. However, I think the star of this entire experience was the Palm Poisson, which is a glorified version of a tater tot served with spicy cod roll and chives from their garden. The next set of courses was a beautifully seared scallop with cauliflower prepared in two different ways, pickled and a puree with salmon roe. The okonomiyaki style pancake is a rolled pancake with charred cabbage and I was told eating this with my eyes closed would mimic as if I was eating a actual okonomiyaki. The entree course was a beautifully seared porchetta with a little bit of pulled pork and also mustard sauce. This was very rich, crispy, and the mustard sauce absolutely cut through the richness of the entire dish, not to mention the smoked potato salad that was served alongside with the porchetta. It was like eating bacon due to the applewood smoke. The last two dishes, one was a cheese course of pear and Maytag blue cheese. Creamy, sweet, and I love the aggressiveness on this cheese choice. And finally, a beautifully crafted chocolate torte with hazelnut crumb and black truffle ice cream. Overall, a wonderful experience at Little Pearl for being at the cheapest menu available in Washington, D.C., starting at $49 without the cocktail and the off-menu snack item. Hey, thanks for watching. If you love this video, give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and hit that bell for notifications on future content on this channel to include my future travel series on other restaurants and also check out some past videos including my Ask the Chef series and also my travel series when I went to Europe two years ago. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video.